Hi, I'm Renee Suzanne, a life coach for women who are sick of the dating scene and ready to find their dream guys. And today I want to tell you how to vet the guys that you're meeting online. I hope you're online and I hope that you have a really amazing dating profile up. And if you do this, then just be online and be on the apps and interact with the guys that you're seeing that with the guys that you match with and I'm gonna tell you how to vet them for the kind of relationship you want and that's I want I want you to vet the guys for the relationship you want not necessarily the guys and I know that it is important to have some attraction for sure but really you need to consider dating people for their relationship skills and not necessarily because honestly at the end of the day it doesn't matter how many countries he's been to or how funny he is if he doesn't have good relationship skills or if he's dating six other women or if he doesn't want to get married and you do so we please start to prioritize actually having the same relationship goals and having relationship skills and being relationship ready and solve for that instead of worrying about his pictures or his passport please please do this you'll be so much happier if you do so you can't cuddle up to a resume he might have a really good profile and some really cute pictures and make you know, $250,000 a year. But if, if he's, again, if he doesn't have time to date you, if he's traveling for business all the time, or he is just unavailable because he's bi-coastal and working 70 hours a week, it really doesn't matter how great his pictures are or how impressive his resume is. So please remember, you cannot cuddle up to a resume. It will not keep you warm at night. You want a real genuine man who is interested in connecting you and wants the same kind of relationship that you do. So I'm going to encourage you to consider the traits that you are looking for in a person, definitely relationship skills. Now, when I'm working with my one-on-one -on -one clients, I encourage them to narrow down their list to five must-haves and to consider going out at least once with anyone who possesses their five must-haves. Now, within reason, he... I'm not going to make you date someone who is 50 years older than you are and lives 5,000 miles away from you. But within reason, you really need to prioritize your five must-haves. So I'll, and they should be character-based must-haves. So when I was dating before I met my husband, my five must-haves were he would, I wanted someone who was intelligent, who was loyal, who was responsible and kind and willing and able to marry me. Those were the five must haves. And guess what? My husband has all of them. And yes, he's attractive. I think he is super attractive. And you know what else he he is not? He's not very funny. And I'm going to I'm going to pick on people a little bit a little tiny 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 bit out of love. But a lot of people tell me, oh, he's got to have a good sense of humor. And I'm like, why? Why does he need to have a sense of humor? Can you not rent a video and laugh with him and get a really good guy? Because I don't think sense of humor belongs in your five must-haves. It really, really doesn't. You can rent a video. My husband is wonderful, and I am really, really, really happy with him. And he's he's not super funny it's it's really is okay i've been happily married to him for almost three years now he's the love of my life and he doesn't make me laugh nonstop. our first date wasn't side splitting humor it's i just probably he hardly ever makes me laugh at all and that's okay i have netflix to make me laugh if i want to laugh so consider what your five must-haves are really and i think it is super important uh, another thing I, I like to pick on a lot is travel destinations you guys can travel someplace together it, he really doesn't need a jazzed up passport to be the love of your life so make sure you're vetting these guys for the things that are really important for the things that really matter when it comes to having a lifelong lasting relationship. Thank you so much for watching. 
And if you like this video and want to find out more about working with me, send me a message at Renee at ReneeSuzanneCoaching.com and we can get you on my calendar and talk about what is happening in your life, in your specific situations and how I can help you as your coach and help you date more effectively so that you can find your dream guy. I will see you next time. Bye.